gentlemen, we are now crossing a zone of turbulence. Please return to your seats and keep your seatbelts fastened. What is up guys, Z here, and we're back today, gonna be playing some forest. Um, now that they finally have an ending included into it, I wanna go ahead and try to make a full playthrough of it. Uh, we're just gonna be playing on normal. They don't, uh, they have hard, but it says it's experimental, and I already kinda suck at the game, so I don't wanna go, <laughs> I don't wanna make it any more harder than what it already is. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead, start here. Now, I've wanted to do a playthrough on the forest forever. I keep trying to start one up, and then, I don't know, We I just kind of lose... I guess I lose sight of what I want to do with it, because there's never... There's never really been a purpose other than just go on this island and survive. Uh, but now they've actually finished making the story. You can actually find your son and conclude it. Um, so I want to go ahead and get a playthrough going... Uh, if you guys enjoy it, let me know by leaving a like, um, hitting that subscribe button, and you know, leave me some comments. Let me know what you guys want to see during the playthrough of the forest, because um, I know there's a lot of people who are playing through it right now, and you know they do some pretty extravagant bases. So if that's something that you guys would want to see, let me know. Uh, I'm always open to whatever. Like I said, I've wanted to play this for a, I've wanted to play through it for a long time. I just never seem to be able to keep it going um, just because I find it to without the story I kind of find survival games to be a bit boring which is my problem with Ark I love Ark Ark's a great game but there's nothing much to do about it like I know they've added in like um, explorable like dossiers that you can find but, I mean, it's pretty much just survive, build a dino army, and fight world bosses. And after you do that, you know, five, six times, there's nothing much to do in the game. Let's go ahead and get some sticks and rocks going here. Um, I think for this first episode today, we're just going to go ahead and try to find... A decent place to call home. Uh, the first place or the first area that we find is probably not going to be too much. Uh, probably just going to buy a, build a small cabin. I think is what they're still calling it. I'm surprised we haven't heard any cannibals yet. Okay, we still need rocks. Okay. But, yeah, like I said earlier, guys, you know, you guys are going to be the ones who kind of dictate how this series goes. You know, let me know what you guys want to see in it, and we'll try to build it around that. Because other than just building and going through the tunnels, I'm not really sure what else to do with the game. Like, I don't know if you guys want to see a lot of building done, or if you guys just want, like... A speed run through the story so you guys can get the story done or what sorry just collect them leaves here there's a lot of these ferns I don't think I've ever seen ferns gathered like this um, 
I don't know about many of you guys, but I've had the Force since, uh, I don't know, almost since it was first released out on Steam for pre-alpha. And I have to say, these guys, they're one of the most active development teams out there. Um, constant updates, you know, and they try to keep you in the loop as best as possible about what's being updated, uh, what the plans are. So, you know, the fact that they finally added an ending to it is actually pretty fucking badass. I think I want to try to find somewhere. Oops. I don't know what happened there. That was a little glitch. Um, I want to try to find somewhere near water that I haven't built before. Because we're up this way, we're going to come across somewhere that like I always build at. Um, and I want to try to get away from places that I build at all the time. Because I think, I think in the forest I have, I don't know, probably roughly a hundred hours clocked into it. So, you know, I've played it numerous times. And every time I play it, I almost always try to start something with it. Like a while back, um, I don't know, a couple months back, me and a buddy of mine were playing. We we're trying to make a series out of it. But it just, it wasn't getting the views that I wanted. Oh, there's an actual animation for skinning now. Cool. I'm not going to grab the heads. Um, oh, damn it. Okay, wait. Why am I using this? Why don't I just bring my spear out? Okay, I know... I know there's a flare gun over here, so let's just go ahead and grab this flare gun real quick. Wash some of that blood off of us. TV star's wife dies. Tragic accident exposed. Oh, it's a rock. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> More circuit boards. That does not look like a comfortable way to die. So. Oh, shit. There's cannibal camp over there. Um, You know what? Why don't we build over in this area? I usually build right around here, so why don't we just kind of cross the pond and see what's up this way. I know, I think there's a little stream up here, and then there's an opening into a cave, which will actually work out fairly nice, because I'll have ac direct access to a cave while I'm over here. What is this? Oh, it's more of these. It didn't, like, the way these things were stacked up, it didn't look like, um suitcases just try to gather up as much of this as I can I think it was a rabbit <laughs> okay yeah here it is here's the campsite that we were looking for you little bastard come here I just want to poke you in the butt where'd you go damn it <laughs> um Hey, Mr. Turtle. Alright. Okay, so I'm thirsty. Uh, I think I picked up some soda. Yeah, let's just go ahead and drink a soda. Uh, I think that gave us a turtle shell, so we don't have to worry about that now. Uh, this water's not going to be deep enough. What about over here? There we go. Okay, so I think we'll build around this area. I don't want to be too close to the cave entrance. Otherwise, you know, we just got to deal with constant waves. I don't know. I think they changed the way the cannibal spawn now. I remember seeing something about it, but I never actually read into it. Um, but there was, I guess there was a bunch of people complaining that the cannibal spawns were a little bit much in the beginning of the game. And so I think they adjusted it just for the little beginnings bit of the game. Okay, you know what? This looks like 
Yeah, this would be a great spot. Okay, so let's go ahead. Uh, shelters. We're just going to go ahead. We'll do a small hunting shelter for the time being. Get this thing turned. Put you there. We get ourselves a fire also. Fire pit. Okay, we just got to grab some more rocks. Looks like we got some down here. Um, okay, I think that's all we needed, right? I know, we actually need eight of them. Oh, okay, I'm all out of room. Alright guys, so we're just making our way back in. We got enough sticks to finish off the stick holder now. Um, let's see. Just gonna grab up some of these rocks while that spawned while we were away. We've already got a good deal of rocks uh, collected up here. Oh, we got a lizard stuck in the base. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, sir. Alright. Let's go ahead and get the uh, campfire started here. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and take these tree stumps out, that way we don't have to worry about them coming back. Any day now. Holy crap. Okay, so now that those things are out of the way, I didn't think it was gonna take that freaking long to do all that. Uh, let's go ahead and grab a bite to eat. And yeah, let's just enjoy the scenery while we're here. Man, we picked the right place for rocks. I mean, good God, look at all the rocks around us. Well, that creeped me out just a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and keep you going. What are you doing? Apparently we could have changed something about the the fire pit. I don't know. We'll have to see next time. I don't think I've tossed another lizard down, did I? Oh, I guess I did. So is that... Oh, maybe now they have a thing where you can just auto-add meat. Go ahead and grab some more there. Yeah, I think that's what that... Uh, I think that's what it does. You can just auto-add meat in there now. Okay, so that's pretty neat. I didn't know about that. Um, so as far as the outline, I think we're going to take it probably right to here because I think they can still climb up from here. And we'll probably just go all the way back uh, back there with it. And same thing on this side. That way we have room for improvement uh, because right now, like I said, this is just going to be a small temporary base. Ooh, can we get you? No, of course not. So that's one. That's one other thing that. That's one other thing that we're gonna have to try to focus on uh, with this next episode. We're gonna go ahead and try to get some hunting equipment done, and there seems to be plenty of rabbits around here. So I might go ahead and make a small animal trap. Um, wow, you were like zigzagging for no reason there, bud. But anyways, guys, I think this is gonna be it for this uh, first episode. We'll go ahead and pick up from here the next time that we leave off, and yeah, so that's probably gonna be it for this one. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the episode, be sure to smash that like button. Hit subscribe because it helps me out a ton. And I'll catch you guys in the next. Peace.